Good morning, School of Light. We are in Ezra chapter 2. Mm. Love homemade coffee. Let's hop right to it. Now, these are the people of the province who came up from the captivity of the exiles. And Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, had taken captive to Babylon. They returned to Jerusalem and Judah, each to his own town, in company with Zerubbabel, Yeshua, Nehemiah, Siraiah, Rilaiah, Mordecai, Bilshan, Mispar, Big Vai, Rehum, and Bena. The list of the men of the people of Israel, the descendants of Parash, two million correction, two thousand one seventy two, of Shephatai, three hundred seventy two, of Ara, seven hundred seventy five, of Pahath, Moab, through the line of Yeshua and Joab, two thousand eight hundred and twelve, of Eliam, twelve hundred and fifty four, Zatu, nine hundred forty five, Zakai, seven sixty, Bani, six forty two, um, Bibai, six twenty three, Asgad, twelve hundred and twenty two, Adon, Adonikam, six sixty six, Big Vai, two thousand fifty six, of Adin, two hundred fifty four, of Adder, 98, of Bezai, 323, of Jorah, 112, of Hashum, 223, of Gebar, 95, men of Bethlehem, 123, of Nef Netophah, 56, of Anoth, Anath, Thoth, 128, of Asmaveth, 42, Kirith, Jerim, Kephriah, and Beiroth, 743, of Ramah, and Geba, 621, of Mikmash, 122, of Bethel, and I, 233, of Nebo, 52, of Magbish, 156, of Eliam, of the other Eliam, 1254, of Haram, 320, of Lod, Haded, and Ono, 725, of Jericho, 345, of Sinai, 3630, the priest, the descendants of Jediah, through the family of Yeshua, of Immer, 973, Emmer 1052, Pashur 1247, of Cherem 1017. The Levites, the descendants of Je Yeshua and Kadmiel through the line of Hodavia 74. The singers, the descendants of Asaph 128. The gatekeepers of the temple, the descendants of Shalom, Atar, Talmon, Akub, Hatita, and Shobai 139. <coughs> the temple servants, the descendants of Jihai, Hashuf, Tabuth, Kerush, Sayah, Pedon. Labana, Hagaba, Akub, Hagib, Shalmai, Hanan, Gedil, Geher, Rechia, Urezen, Nekoda, Gezem, Uza, Pase, Bese, Asna, Miunim, Nefusim, Bakbuk, Hakufur, Fa, Haruch, Bezuluth, Bezluth, Mechada, Harsha, Barkos, Sisera, Tema, Neziah, and he Hatafa. Hatafa. The descendants of the servants of Solomon, the descendants of Sota, Heshophereth, Peruda, Jela, Darkon, Gedil, Shephatai, Hatil, Pokereth, Hazabim, and Ami. The temple servants and the descendants of the servants of the Solomon, 392 the following, came up from the towns of Tel Mehil, Tel Harsha, Kerub, Adon, Emmer, but they could not show that their families were descended from Israel. The descendants of Deliah, Tobiah, and Nekoda, 652. And from among the priests, the descendants of Hobiah, Hekos, and Brazilia, a man who had married a daughter of Brazela, Brazile, Brazili, Brazila, E. The Gildite <coughs> and was called by that name. They searched for their family records, but they could not find them. So they were excluded from the priesthood as unclean. The governor ordered them not to eat any of the most sacred food until there was a priest ministering with the Urim and the Thummim. The whole company <coughs> numbered 42,360, besides their 7,337 men servants and maidservants. And they also had 200 men and women, singers, 
They had 76 horses, 245 mules, 435 camels, and 6,720 unkies. When they arrived at the house of the Lord in Jerusalem, some of the heads of the families gave free will offerings toward the rebuilding of the house of God and its site. According to their ability, they gave the treasury for its work 61,000 drachmas of gold and 5,000 minas of silver and 100 priestly garments. The priests, the Levites, the singers, and the gatekeepers and the temple servants settled in their own towns along with some of the other people and the rest of the Israelites settled in their towns. Wow, that's a um, detailed account. I kind of... Well, even though I read it, so these are people who came up in captivity. Okay, so these are people that came up from captivity, all these big numbers. And they were from different people. Of Zatu, of Banai, um, Aden, for example, Senei, Senei, 3000. So these are the people that came, that were returned to Jerusalem and Israel after they were taken captive into Babylon. I got it. Remember, I think Cyrus is the one that rebuilt the temple and started returning the, um, what were they called? Captives. I think they were captives. So, my takeaway, serve God, fear him, put him first, be strong, otherwise you yourself could be taken captive. Not physically, but by other things in life. God bless. I hope that helps. If you need Bible studies, let me know.